Hello happy friends! Are you ready to learn? I'm Sarah and today we're going to learn a little more about the seasons and to do this we're going to learn what the hemispheres are. We all know that there are four seasons in a year. Spring, summer, autumn and winter and that each season has different weather conditions. In winter, it's very cold. In spring, temperatures start to rise and flowers start to blossom. In summer, it's extremely hot. And in autumn, temperatures start to decrease and leaves start falling from the trees. But did you know that not all the seasons happen at the same time all over the world? Nope, so let's find out why. Planet Earth has an axis which is an imaginary line where the Earth spins around itself in a rotational movement. This axis isn't up straight, it's actually leaning. And depending on the month of the year, there are areas that receive more heat than others. Our planet is divided into two parts. It's separated by an imaginary line called the equator. And this imaginary line separates the planet into two hemispheres, the northern hemisphere and the southern hemisphere. Now let's see how a planet moves around the Sun. It is what we call a translation movement. As you can see, the Sun heats the Earth. But not equally around the whole world. Let's stop the planet. Stop! In this position, the Northern Hemisphere has more sun rays because of the axis inclination. And that means that we're in summer! And meanwhile in the Southern Hemisphere, it's winter. Oof, I prefer summer. But what happens if the Earth rotates on the other side of the sun? Well, this means that the Southern Hemisphere will receive more sun rays Meaning that in the Northern Hemisphere, it's winter and in the Southern Hemisphere, it's summer. It's easy peasy, huh? Goodbye, happy friends. See you next time and I hope you're always ready to learn. Goodbye.